In this video, I will show you how you can open multiple sub accounts on the VMAX exchange so you can long and short Bitcoin at the same time on the one main account. And guys, this is one of the main advantages VMAX exchange is offering because you can manage multiple accounts on the one account so you could manage uh, yeah, different Bitcoin wallets, but that also means you can long and short at the same time. And this we usually don't see with different exchanges. If you have other leverage exchanges, you need to make multiple accounts if you want to long and short at the same time. Because most exchanges, they just allow you to have one position open at a certain time. So it's actually quite simple. You go under your account right here. You click on sub account. Then you click right here on this button, add sub account. And now the account is added to your sub accounts. And if you want to enter that sub account, you can just hover with your mouse over account. And then you can just select the sub account that you created or the sub account that you want to enter. So let's say we would open a position right here in our main account. Then yes, confirm. Just, uh, yeah, we do that as a test. So to illustrate that, guys, we have opened a yeah, really small position right here, but it's a long position. And if I right now go to account and then below here, we can see the sub accounts and I change the name of that account. Uh, one I change to high leverage, one I, I change to short account, but let's say we go to the short account. And if we go to the short account, we can see there are no uh, positions open right now. So right now we can open a short position right here, but these accounts, these sub accounts, you need to fund separately. And if you want to change the name of your sub account, you go to that specific sub account and then you click right here on account. And then here you can see the name and you can click on change and there you can change the name to, uh, yeah, to anything you want. And that provides a better overview when you want to switch between accounts. So it is quite easy to add those sub accounts and to switch between those accounts. And I also think that this is one of the big advantages that the Vmix exchange is offering. But okay guys, that was it for this video about how you can open and manage sub accounts on the Vmix exchange. I'm going to make more videos about the functionalities that the Vmix exchange is offering. And if you want to learn more about how the Vmix exchange is working, how you can execute orders, you can watch my Vmix tutorial. If you like this video, then please leave a thumbs up. And as always, guys, I see you all tomorrow. And don't forget to huddle.